The Curiosity rover has made an amazing discovery. It found bright yellow crystals on Mars, a sight that has left scientists in awe. These crystals are pure sulfur, a rare find on the Martian surface. This is the first time we've ever seen sulfur like this on another planet, making it a groundbreaking discovery. It's a huge moment for space exploration, marking a significant milestone in our quest to understand Mars. The crystals were hiding inside a rock, waiting to be uncovered. Curiosity used its advanced tools to crack the rock open, revealing the hidden treasure. That's when the treasure was revealed, sparkling brightly in the Martian landscape. The crystals glittered in the Martian sunlight, a sight that made scientists ecstatic. This discovery wasn't just luck, it was the result of meticulous planning and exploration. Curiosity was exploring a special place called Gadiz Vallis, a region of great interest. Scientists believe water once flowed there like a river, shaping the landscape over time. Finding these crystals in Gediz Vallis is like finding a seashell on a beach, a clue to Mars's ancient past. It tells a story of what Mars was like long ago, offering a glimpse into the planet's geological history. These sulfur crystals are more than just pretty, they are clues to Mars's past. On Earth, crystals like these often form around volcanoes or hot springs. Could the same be true for Mars? Scientists are puzzled. They didn't expect to find pure sulfur crystals on the surface of Mars. The Martian atmosphere makes it difficult for these crystals to survive. So, how did they get there? The discovery challenges what we thought we knew about Martian geology. It suggests that the planet might be even more active and complex than we imagined. Every new piece of information, especially a surprise like this, helps us understand Mars a little bit better. The presence of sulfur crystals in Geddes Vallis is particularly exciting. These crystals are not just random formations, they hold clues to Mars's geological and possibly hydrological past. Remember, this area may have once been a riverbed. The landscape suggests that water might have flowed here, carving out paths and leaving behind these intriguing formations. On Earth, sulfur is often associated with water. It can be found in hot springs, volcanic areas, and places where water has interacted with minerals. Could these crystals be a sign that water once flowed on Mars? The possibility is tantalizing and opens up many questions about the planet's history. The search for water on Mars is a big deal. It's one of the primary objectives of our Mars missions, as water is a key ingredient for life. Water is essential for life as we know it. Finding it on Mars would be a monumental discovery, suggesting that the planet could have supported life. If Mars had water in the past, it might have had life too. Microbial life could have thrived in these ancient waters, leaving behind traces for us to find. And if we find evidence of past life on Mars, it would change everything. It would mean that life is not unique to Earth and could exist elsewhere in the universe. Even if we don't find aliens, discovering evidence of past water on Mars would be a major scientific breakthrough. It would provide insights into the planet's climate and geological history. It would mean that Mars was once a much more Earth-like planet than it is today. This knowledge could help us understand the potential for life on other planets and guide future exploration. Section 4, Curiosity's Quest. Curiosity has been exploring Mars for over a decade, tirelessly roaming the Martian surface. It's a rover about the size of a small car, but with capabilities far beyond its size. It's packed with scientific instruments and tools, each designed for specific scientific tasks. It's like a mobile laboratory on Mars conducting experiments and analyzing samples. Since landing in 2012, Curiosity has been on an incredible journey, exploring the Gale Crater. It has driven across craters, climbed hills, and even drilled into rocks to uncover Mars's secrets. Along the way, it has sent back breathtaking images and valuable data, enriching our understanding of the Red Planet. The discovery of the sulfur crystals is just one of Curiosity's many accomplishments, showcasing its scientific prowess. It has also found evidence of organic molecules, which are the building blocks of life, hinting at Mars's potential for habitability. It has studied the Martian atmosphere and weather patterns, providing insights into the planet's climate. It has even taken selfies, capturing its own journey and the stunning Martian landscape. Section 5. The Red Planet Beckons. Mars has captivated humans for centuries. It's the planet next door, and it's the most similar to Earth in our solar system. For centuries, we've looked up at the night sky and wondered, could there be life on Mars? 
Today, we are closer than ever to answering that question. Thanks to missions like Curiosity, we are learning more about Mars than ever before. We are piecing together the history of this fascinating planet. The discovery of the sulfur crystals is a reminder that Mars is full of surprises. It's a planet of wonder and mystery. It's a place that continues to spark our imagination and fuel our desire to explore. Section 6. Are We Alone? The search for life beyond Earth is one of humanity's most profound quests. It's a question that has haunted us for millennia. Are we alone in the universe? The discovery of the sulfur crystals on Mars might seem like a small step, but it's part of a much larger journey. Each new piece of information, each discovery, brings us closer to answering that fundamental question. Perhaps one day, we will find definitive proof that life exists beyond our planet, or perhaps we will discover that we are truly alone in the vastness of space. Either way, the search itself is a testament to the human spirit of curiosity and exploration.